Here we go. Got everything? Yeah, I'm okay. Here, honey. An offering for the king. <laughs> See you later, Mom. Listen to your teacher, okay? And, uh, give the king my best. Dance with an angel, Mom. Yeah. Maybe we'll tango today instead of waltz. That's our way of saying goodbye. My husband is an Air Force pilot and refers to fighter planes as angels. When he'd go on a mission that kept him away from home, I'd tell him in frustration to go dance with his angels. Matilda grew up hearing this, and now she uses it all the time. There's a nice view of the King's Bridge from our house. That iron giant is the pride of Grace Maria, our capital city. In the old quarter of the city beyond the bridge, you can make out an ancient castle, which is even more famous than the bridge. My daughter Matilda is going there on a field trip today. In the throne room rests the Golden King. He's been smiling for a good 600 years now. The king was a gentle person who was a bit on the small side, but he crafted a giant suit of armor that convinced his enemies to surrender without a single fight. Afterwards, they found such warmth in his smile that they bowed down to him in humility. Anyway, that's how the story goes. His smiling face still touches the hearts of our people. The very face my daughter and the others got on a bus to see this morning. That was a brand new day. The song on the radio seems to be a perfect match for the sunny weather. what's happening that awful sound and the shaking was that a blast of wind from an explosion the castle disappeared behind a pillar of flame Attention all pilots! Our capital city, Grace Maria, is under attack by unknown aircraft. Damage from the attacks is widespread throughout the city. All planes scramble and intercept all threats immediately.
team, time to take off.
targets and run them down. Enemy at 6 o'clock.
Combat zone. Maintain your course west to leave the airspace. West, half west. Roger. Heading over to engage the enemy. Garuda team, you've made it out of the combat zone. Head for the rendezvous point. I promise we'll be back for you. Just a little longer. I promise. smoke rises from the city before me. The King's Bridge is gone. No. no. Matilda! I vaguely hear a scream of terror that sounds much like my own voice from afar. Though the Golden King's gentle smile is moving, moving farther away from me. Every now and then, I tell my daughter the story of the night some years ago. A night when the sky was radiant with shooting stars. That night, your father and I made countless wishes together. An asteroid called Ulysses came into Earth's orbit and disintegrated into millions of pieces which poured down on the land below. As we watched the shooting stars that night, fragments from the asteroid rained down on our eastern neighbor, Estovakia, damaging a great deal of their infrastructure and devastating their economy. Soon after, the news reported that their nation had fallen into a civil war, one that would last for years. Eventually, the internal strife was brought to an end when the generals came into power. In the midst of hardship, the citizens of Estovakia were convinced that the only way they could recover as a nation was to rely on a military government led by these generals. Before long, they went so far as to invade our nation, the Republic of Ameria. Our military was forced to retreat to Kesid, an island far to the west. My husband, a 
fighter pilot. Also hasn't come home since. <laughs>